Oh yeah, something good's about to go down. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy James to the O. I made a video about these two girls. They were very similar to one another's case. They both were the same exact age. They did the same exact everything. But this girl in Tennessee ain't free, though. The other one that happened in Cali, she's free. She served 19 years after her stuff being commuted down. But anyways, so early in the morning, 3 o'clock, I went to the gym playing fitness. Was watching some old YouTube videos, and then something just popped up right in my mind. This girl, Centoya Brown, I was like, what? Like, how did her name come up out of nowhere in my brain? How did that work? But someone was telling me to go look up something, see what's going on. So I went to Google, said her name on a little speaker thing. And they talking about she got a court date. I was like, what? Nuh uh. I said, let me, let me click that article. She got a court date in June? This is May the 3rd. June the 14th? I think something good gonna happen. Her story was this. She was being used as a prostitute. I think she was a victim of human trafficking, abuse, on drugs, wherever, wherever. She was, she basically had a rough life as a kid growing up. They said that she said that the guy was gonna kill her in his house. So she got a gun shot and killed him. But the auto spy reports, forensic evidence suggested otherwise. They said that this man was laying in bed sleep face first and she got a gun went over there shot him in the back of the head while he sleep bow dead killed him in his sleep took his car keys took his money his wire everything, and drove off gone and she called please told please there's a dead man in this house blah blah she basically told on herself yeah she incriminated herself in the investigator room whatever, whatever took it all the way to trial tries an adult found her guilty of murder first degree Robbery first degree. 51 years of life at 16. And she gonna be damn near 70 before she's even eligible? I don't know, that's too much. So then I learned this morning that she's gonna have a, a upcoming court date. So I'm thinking maybe they'll overturn it. Maybe they'll commute her sentence and make it less maybe they'll make her cop a plea deal for a lesser charge and maybe give her time sir she's been in since 2004 we are in 2018 that's 14 years in that's a long way to go from 14 to 51 probably 50 years later we probably didn't forgot about her if she was a do 50 I doubt it. I think what's going to happen is they're going to let her plea bargain something less. Because Sarah Cruz ain't had the same exact crap. Killed somebody. Took their money and their wallet and their car keys. Drove off. Got busted. Got tries in the door at 16. She got life without. But she got 51 to life. I don't go. Neither one of them deserve that junk. I think juveniles should get a second chance, considering the circumstances they're kids. They don't know no better. Now, should they do jail time for what they did? Yes. They shouldn't get all scot-free, but 51 years of life, that's harsh. That is harsh. I think she's going to be freed. I strongly believe that. She's going to be freed. She got her college education. Took advantage of the programs that was offered to her while she was in prison in Tennessee, which is great. Maybe some things could be used as time credit or something to help her. I personally believe court date coming up, her sentence going to get reduced. I don't think they're going to overturn it. I don't think they're going to throw it completely out. That would be nice. I don't think that's going to happen. I think this is going to be... We're going to let you plea bargain down to like probably manslaughter maybe or drop it down to second degree. Probably manslaughter, I'm thinking. This is me thinking. I believe. Yeah, manslaughter would be a real good charge to plea bargain down to. It ain't 51 of life. They might say manslaughter, time serves, or Mary reduce it to murder too. But it is a 
That's what they did to Terry Cruz and out here in California. Arnold Schwarzenegger, before he left office, he commuted her to life with 25 years possibility of parole. The Riverside County DA's office went, okay, well, we'll drop that down from first degree to second and give you 15 in life. Person use a firearm, which is four years in California, they always hit you with 19 L. She was already at 19. Got parole. Maybe Centoya Brown might get the same exact thing this one had. We're going to find out on that court date, June, June the 14th, June something of this year, one month away. I can't wait. I think it's going to be something good out of it. I strongly believe that. Free Centoya Brown. Free her. Let her go. She's a victim. She didn't have to kill that dude in his sleep, but still. But nevertheless, it's similar to that other girl's story. 14 years in, I think this is the year that she walks. You tell me what you think of that story. That story is deep. Like, comment, share, subscribe, this video, tell me what you think. Let me know something. I think she's going to be freed some kind of way.